Pretty vast. Indeed. And now, sir, allow me to show you a handful of interesting details. Follow me, please. Been a major domo all your life? Yes, I come from a long line of major domos. My father was a major domo, as was my grandfather before him, as was my great aunt. In fact, she was the one to start the. Aunt. A hard woman. It is said that already as a child, she knew where she was going and went there. When she arrived in Beauclair, she signed on as a chambermaid at one of the vineyards and slowly worked her way up to Major Domo. She dragged the rest of the family up the same path. What do you get for all that work? A crook in your back, but so on in the... the servants' quarters. I occupy the green home. Their salaries to be paid from the ducal treasure. Nice of her. Not the most sightly part of the estate, I admit. But I think it's worthwhile for you as master of the domain to know where the help stays. Baron Rossell ordered the vines in this part of the estate uprooted and olive groves planted in their place. They look beautiful, especially come spring. Don't look at all bad now, either. I liked you from the start. Every witcher I've known has been a star. Down below lies your vineyard, where we grow a strain of Carfaneri, one of the world's oldest. Aged in oak barrels, it provides for an exquisite wine with distinct blackberry, wild cherry, plum, and cinnamon notes. Marvelous. Have to try it one of these days. If I had just take to work, is the thing Nice well. Picturesque. Yes, though it ran dry long ago. During the raucous feasts Master Bolius held, he would order it filled with wine. There's a tale about a guest attending a Bolius ball for the first time and thus unaware of the custom. He had suffered great heartburn and had decided to end his life by jumping into the well. The festivities were coming to a close and the well was nearly empty when the suicidal guest finally jumped. Instead of killing himself, he nearly broke his legs. To numb the pain, he drank the wine. Drank himself to death? N not at all. When found the next day, he had concluded he'd witnessed twin miracles. The water had been changed into wine, and he had survived. He retired to a monastery in the Dragon Mountains and began preaching the wisdoms of Nebioda. Monsieur Bolius's wife, Nina, kept a garden here. A supremely lovely place it was. A bit neglected now. I agree. Yet nothing stands in the way of restoring it to its former glory and once again planting it with herbs and other vegetation. Madame Nina planted diminutive, delicate flowers and herbs here. One might say their aroma still hangs in the air. You're quite the romantic, Barnabas Basil. Wine. 
This served as an additional wine cellar in years of plentiful harvests. Hmm. Bit of work, and it'll make a fine stable for Roach. The cellars, voila. During Monsieur Bolis's time, wine was kept here, but Baron Rossello used it to store olive oil as well. I took the liberty of cleaning up the mess which I made while fighting the Bruxa. Thanks, Barnabas Basil. Appreciate it. As you can see, the facade is, how to put it, slightly stained. But one cannot deny it a certain subtle southern charm. True, though it could use a bit of subtle paint. And welcome inside. On the left is the master bedroom. On the right, the dining hall and kitchen. Upstairs, we shall find the guest room, currently used for storage. Not a bad idea. At the moment, the house is only minimally furnished. Yet I believe we will, together, devise some innovative arrangements. A few paintings, for instance, would breathe new life into the abode immediately. With that, sir, you've seen the full lay of the land. Corfo Bianco is a beautiful estate. But one must admit, time has taken its toll. If Forgive me for being forward, but if you were to choose to invest a small sum towards its beautification, consider me at your service on the matter. Think I'll take you up on that. Be sure to come and see you if I decide to do any remodeling. Mentioned the place could stand to be spruced up. Almost decidedly, sir. The question is where you would like to begin this rejuvenation. Got these spacious grounds, mm, but maybe it's time to make them more uh, useful. Oh yes, we certainly should. The way I see things, given your trade, sir, you would be wise to put in a grindstone and an armorous table. A good way to start things off, don't you think? My armor needs work from time to time. You know, oil this, reinforce that. Could use a decent work table where I could do all that. Admiral Rompali once hired a specialist who made the finest armorous tables this side of the Yeruga. I will contact him at once. Hmm. Know what? Might not be the best time to lay out that kind of coin. Let me sleep on it. Ponder the notion however long you wish, sir. I am at your disposal always. Let's put a pin in this for now. Remembered I have some urgent business to tend to. Not the slightest problem, sir. I am here to surf whenever you desire.
How might I be off surface, sir? Thanks. Gotta get back to my business now. See you soon. Eat something. Nourish yourself. Sure, you go time. on. You you drink drink while you're young. It's hard and good. Bread adds a spring to your step. Wine at all. Man who dare not down some wreck is a man whose wife's like to... Ah, cheap shenanigans. I can't see a thing through these cataracts. La vie. Might be worth looking into. This is Beauclair, not mm. <laughs> Now drink us some pick your put. I've always dreamt of travel. Best steel in all of Tusa. Take a gander. Show me what you have.
think you could craft something for me? Farewell. No, see you later. something for me? Farewell. No, see you later. Here it's wine, wine, and more wine.
Jones and Elder Speech. Salvation lies not in Dan after the Professor's journals. Long gone. Glory be as somebody else else found out about it too. Should look around, see if I can find something else. <laughs> Professor certainly can't do much to help me with my search. Footprints, narrow and shallow. Somebody small, light. Woman, maybe? Wonder where they lead. Damn it, trail breaks off. Wonder if the grave robber learned more than I did. Hmm, won't learn anything else here. Map Yen sent me will have to do. So, Epitaph mentioned both Elorin and Dolnevde, Valley of the Nine. Rolling on an empty stomach. Oh, the serendipity. I'm so glad you're back. Master Witcher, what luck to happen upon you. Got work for me? New contract? Of the contract in question, you acquitted yourself beautifully years past, on your last sojourn in Beauclair. I was in a bit of a bind at the time, do you remember? Yet I swore a solemn vow to pay you in full one day. Guess it rings a bell. Sadly, you went on your way before I could settle matters with you. So, I took your coin and placed it in an account for safekeeping. Hmm. What kind of account? A savings account at Chanfanelli Bank. You need but walk in and withdraw. The sum must be rather substantial by now. Thanks. Head over there first chance I get. Gotta stop by that bank. Welcome to Gianfinelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, and the customer's always right. How might I be of service? Got an account here. Like to make a withdrawal. 
Naturally. Your name? Geralt of Rivia. Wait a moment, please, while I find the relevant record. I can't help you. Extraordinary circumstances, you see. There's a note in the records. The account holder is dead. That's inaccurate, as you can see. It's some kind of mistake. The note is clearly an error. To reactivate the account, you'll need permit 838. For more information, please go to window number one. All right. Where's window number one? Mm-hmm. Permit 838. Look at that. Welcome to Chanfanili Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, etc., etc. How can I help you, sir? I'd like to reactivate my account, so I need a copy of Permit A38. <laughs> wrong window, I fear. What do you mean, wrong window? I was told I'd get Permit A38 here. Please remain calm, sir, or you'll rupture a vein. So just tell me where I get this stupid document. Perhaps upstairs, in records, or downstairs in the archive. You must ask them, sir. Do just that. Collins, I was... What can I do for you? <laughs> Sorry, gotta get through. Hold there. What is this? Back off the queue, sir. Welcome to Chanfanelli Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own. And the customer is always right. How might I help you? This where I get permit A38? Naturally. Just hand me your form 202, please. Form 202? Just what are you trying to pull? Sir, I'm not pulling anything. Just following procedure. Permit A38 can only be issued upon presentation of form 202, as stated specifically in ordinance N60. Please, go to window number one. <sighs> Just came from there. Never mind. Be back shortly with Form 202. You cut in front of me, sir! Give a crap. You boar, you churl! I will not stand for this! Just you wait, I'll teach you some manners! Go on, hit me. Oh, gentlemen, if you wish to raise a ruckus, do it outside. Outside, now! Can I help you? Sure, I do this little mosaic. 
safer place than a bank. <sighs> there, there's a catch. So you see, she claims puffed sleeves will be in fashion next season. Excuse me. Got something I gotta Puff? take care of at window you one. cannot be serious. I too find it hard to believe. Excuse so me. Can you not see what it says there? We're on our break. Celine, darling, sign this for me, will you? Oh, there you are. Listen, there's something We're on I... break. Ah, you try to be polite, it just never gets through. Got no choice, I guess. I was at home the other day, just sitting, when suddenly, knock, knock, I opened the door. You must wait. They have the break now. So... What do you hope to get here, my friend? Permit A38. Though, guess I need Form 202 as well now. Form 202? Easy peasy. Certificate P. Now, that is a challenge. But, as we are both forced to wait, fancy a round of Gwent. See, you know this place pretty well. Must have taken care of a good amount of business. Oh, naturally, my friend. Naturally. Indeed, I've managed to work the system a time or two. You see, such things require finesse. Subtlety. Otherwise, you're stuck. I have seen them try everything. Magic, hypnosis, bribery. Nothing works. Might as well go if nothing works. There's nothing I can do? Be kind. Be pleasant. This and only this. The woman here, she sits at her window 12 hours each day without hearing so much as a good day from anyone. But muster up some flowers, some perfume. Well, you will resolve your matter lickety-split. <laughs> right. Certainly worth a shot. Ah, good luck. Welcome to Chanfanili Bank, where we look after your coin as if it were our own, etc., etc. How can I help you, sir? Need Form 202 to get a copy of Permit A38. Do you know that? Couldn't have told me? Wasted a lot of time because of you. Please, sir. There's no need to lose your temper. I thought it obvious and thus needed no stating. 
The form was Sunday ready. Name and surname? Geralt of Rivia. Let me find it. Get on, Gemel. Here it is. Geralt of Rivia. Sorry, sir, I cannot issue Form 202. Excuse me? The applicant in question has been declared dead. Officially. Now, do tell me, sir, how am I to enter that into the ledger? Got you some flowers, just to thank you for helping me with my file. Oh, but I... I shouldn't. For me? Really? Match the color of your eyes. Oh. You, sir, are quite the charmer. Ah, please, wait a moment. I shall fetch Master Cinfanelli. Perhaps he'll arrange something that excludes the paperwork. You tell him Danny disturbed, but no, always some bugger who can't stand to wait. Plow me, who's this? Hearty greetings, Master Geralt. You haven't paid us a visit in eons. Been a bit busy, but I'm back now and I need your help with something. Of course. Now do tell, how can I help you? Got a problem with my account. Wanted to withdraw some coins, see, but. No problem there. We'll get you paid up in a jiffy. I'm just gonna need to settle yon tiny wee trifle. Heard that already. Permit A38, among others. Oh, my hands are tied without them, Geralt. But I see you're a quick learner in the ways of banking. You'll get them in a heartbeat. Chanfinelli, no more excuses. Pay out my coin, now. Come on, Master Witcher, for why the ire? There's no need. We'll have it all for you. You just need to see the necessary documents. Got a document right here means a hell of a lot more than any of your forms or permits. Have a look. Uh, her enlightened highness, she's hired you. Mm-hmm. And as her personal emissary, I demand access to my account, right now. Uh, uh, aye, Master Witcher. This way. So how's the trade these days, Master Witcher? Can't complain. Good for you, because in our neck of the woods, things are dark, dark shite. Wine sales are stuck in the muck and sinking deeper. It's the fucking wretched names, I tell you. Folk out with the duchy have me any notion how to say yes. coat de blessure yeah. and all that. All it twists order. their tongues in bloody knots. Makes them ashamed to ask for it. Done. Deposit box 256. Last you on the right. What the hell's this, Chenfinelli? Box is empty. Well, uh, coins got to circulate. So when we learned you were dead, Master, we, uh, circulated yours. Purchased stocks, bonds, invested in a few vineyards. Before we knew it, there was hee-haw left in the box. Really ought to call it what it is. You robbed me, plain and simple. Nay, Master Witcher, never! I wouldn't dare! Oh, you'd dare. And now you'll answer for it. Open the gate. Master Witcher, I'll pay it all back, every red copper. I swear it on my nana's beard. Fooled me once, not about to let you fool me again. Master Geralt, I beg you, keep your heat. We can work this out, I know we can. Rip that coin out of your throat if I have to. Guards, help! I do. Scalp the wee shite! 
Get my hands on that twit. I, Marianne, close the account and pay the man his coin. Thank you. Master Witcher, your coin. Just don't go making any mere trouble, all right? This it? Expected a few thousand at least. Well, there's things to account for. Taxes, inflation, and so on. The economy's nobody's fault, is it? <sighs> Might have guessed. Ah, and Master Witcher, one more thing. Don't come back to my bank ever again. Can do without patrons like you. Get out! Get out! A fruitful hunt to you, Witcher. Not for the crowns I've got them. Some mad men's been running about the docks. He's bad noodle at the merchants. Your boots could use some. Wish it was you. Stinky. You shan't find anything better.
Kicker it all. Whoa! Take it for a ride. Dropping Bancombe a witcher. Thin strikers around here. Surely you have techniques. You'd get it to that as best. He looks like a neat-witted Nancy to me. Do you wish to jump in? Considering it. So you're... Fine, let's start. Oh, my knees quake like a carnival rattle. Let's get on with this ridiculous battle. I'm a top taunter, the best around, not one to be beaten by some inbred hound. Your taunts? I've heard dogs wretch things more profound. Hear how pathetic and stupid you sound. Well, how then is this for a clever tongue twister? You're a bum-botching, blackened, bile-filled blister. Think you're confused. That sounds more like your sister. I'm immune to disease, but even I'd die if I kissed her. You aren't worthy to empty my sister's bedpan. You mange-ridden mutant, not even a man! Should have quit before we began. Gonna make you wish you'd turn tail and ran. Why, you... bad... Uh, uh, I've got to admit, you know how to roast a man. You win. Mean we're not gonna fight? Why? I told you, you've won. The Witcher wins, beating Mancombe at his own game. You out-tongued me, but only because I'm under the weather today. I'd have lashed you raw otherwise. Right, sure. Two more champions to defeat before you can challenge the Maestro. Still Waters is to be found in Oatville, not far from Mount Bank Alley, while Colossus fights in the largest courtyard in San Sebastian. Right, let's dance!